If you experience an industrial emergency, Atlas Machine and Supply can get your business back up and running as fast as humanly possible. Our team is available 24-7 with the skills and experience to solve the biggest problems, even if that problem weighs 22,000 pounds like this bracket. This crucial piece of equipment was damaged during a steel mill explosion, forcing the plant's production into an expensive standstill. This is a bracket that holds the electrode that melts down the steel in the furnace. When they had the explosion, that forced the arm in an upward direction and distorted the beam. We got a call from the customer the night before when they were still taking it apart. They wanted us to go ahead and do all the pre-planning just in case they did take it out to send it. We got the truck lined up, scheduled the people for around the clock service, contracted the company out of Michigan. There's quite a bit of prep work. When it came in, we had people all over it. It was like a little ants all over it. What we had to do is push the beam back into place where it was distorted. When the distortion was fixed on the outside, then we had to cut into the structure of the arm to go in and fix all the internal damage. And fixing the internal damage, then we had the windows that we cut out, we had to weld back in. The thing that complicated it some, this unit carries current from one end to the other. And it's basically just like a big copper wire. It's copper clad on the outside, Copper cladding is what carries the current. So after we did all the repair, then we had to go back and have a company out of Michigan come. They recladded the areas that were repaired and blended it all in. We had the thing basically pushed back in shape in a very short time. I've often said if Atlas does anything better than anybody in the world, get a customer out of a big bad bind like that. If the customer calls and they're hurting, need something done in an emergency, we're the best in the world at that. We're just the best at it, always have been.